back with more Tales of the Abyss. He's in trouble. No, no, he's not. Oh, yeah, he is. Hey, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. I just used too strong a Dothic phonic art. Hmm. He didn't choose his voice actor too well. You're the two from Engave yesterday. I'm Luke. Hmm. Luke, that means Light of the Sacred Flame in ancient Espanyan. I'm Locrian Sergeant Tyr Grants. First Platoon Oracle Knights Intelligence Division under Grand Maestro Mo's command. Ah, oh, you're Van's younger sister. I've heard of you. This is the first time we've met, isn't it? You're Master Van's sister? Then what was with you trying to kill- Kill him. I don't know what- How did I hit X? I wasn't even touching it. I'm not- I wasn't even touching the controller. How did that happen? Kill him? Sorry, it's nothing. Just something between us. Don't try to avoid the question. If you're his sister, why are you trying to kill him? It's... I... It's a cheagle! Hmm. So they do live here. Come on, we're gonna catch that thing. Would it be best if I don't inquire about you and Van? I'm sorry. It relates to my homeland. I'd prefer not to get you or Luke involved. This is only gonna hey, it's gonna get away! On. Let's go! What? Oh, right. Hey, what are you even doing here if you can't fight? Get out I'm sorry, I just wanted to find out what really happened. Well, that makes two of us. Or rather... Hmm? Why? It's none of your business. Well, it's not any of my business either. Cheagles are sacred creatures. If they're hunting people, they must have some reason behind it. Not necessarily. As one who's connected to the Cheagles, I cannot sit idly... Well, they're just monsters, right? Just leave them alone. I can't. Maybe I'm strange that way, but that's how I am. Anyway, if we find the Cheagles, we should be able to learn what's going on. Whatever, let's just go find those Cheagles already. Well, that's what we're doing, you know. Flying snails. Sounds like a girl. Cheagles are intelligent and peaceful creatures. It's not like them to steal food. Hmm. Well, looks like we're both headed to the same place then. The two of you came here to investigate the Cheagles too? I'm not gonna just let people accuse me of things I didn't do. And you're coming with us. Really? You don't mind? 
How can you think of taking Phone Master Ion somewhere so dangerous? Then what do you want to do with him? He'll just come wandering back here on his own. Ugh. He's right there. I'm sorry, I just have to know. Cheagles are the sacred beasts of our order, after all. Phone Master Ion... Or not, I expected maybe somebody tall wearing armor, not a little kid. See? Besides, we can't just leave a guy with a face so pale he looks like he's about to die. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. You're such a nice person, Luke. Uh... <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Now, quit saying stupid stuff and let's go. That's a compliment, dude. Okay. Ion doesn't seem very smart. And don't use that weird art again. You damn near passed out. We'll take care of the fighting. You're gonna protect me? Sir Luke, I'm so moved. That particular, I'm guessing, actress and tone more would fit uh, some pampered princess than somebody who's supposed to be fairly dangerous. A leader of an entire her order. That's not what I meant. You'll just be in the way. Don't get all worked up over it. You're only making the situation just Luke. work. it's Luke. Got it? Now let's go. Okay, Luke. be the Cheagle's nesting area. I'd be highly surprised if Phone Master Ion's voicer was actually yeah, not a woman. I do hope we can find some proof they stole food from the village. Those stupid things probably left proof all over the place. Let's explore a little. Ion just seems a little bit dim at times. Anyways, if this were an anime, I'd probably stop watching it, but I... Since it's a game, I... And not, not to mention one of... These apples have the mark of Engave on them! Like stickers or whatever? Since this is a game, and... It's pretty cool, I'm... <laughs> I'm gonna keep at it. So, these guys did do it! Probably not. I think I hear something inside this tree. Cheagles live inside tree trunks. Phone Master, that's too dangerous. This kid is hopeless. Please, let me through. Meow, 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 meow. That sounds like, like a person saying that rather than... And just the noise man on there. Like the monsters are gonna understand you. The Order's founder, Yulia Jue, made a pact with the Cheagles and gained their aid. Or so I've been told. 
Mew, 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 mew. Are you of relation to Yulia Jewett? Whoa, that monster talked. It is the power of the ring we were granted as part of our pact with Yulia. Are you of relation to Yulia? Yes, I'm Ion, phone master of the Order of Lorelei. Am I correct in assuming that you're the Cheagle Elder? Indeed, I am. Yeah, it says right over her text boxes. Hey, monster, you guys stole food from and gave, right? I see now. So you've come to exterminate us. Hmm, so you don't deny it. Cheagles are herbivores. Why do you need to steal human food? To preserve the Cheagle tribe? It doesn't look what? like you lack food. There's plenty of vegetation in this forest. One of our members caused a fire in the northern region. You'd think that would, you know, soil a lot, of, a lot more fertile? As a result, the ligers that lived there moved down to this forest. Oh, no problem. I'll take them out. In order to prey on us. Then the reason you stole the food was so your people wouldn't be eaten. Correct. If they aren't sent food periodically, we Cheagles are captured and eaten. A little bit cliche, but okay. That's horrible. And totally not our problem. If you're weak, you're food. That's how it works. Besides, I'd be mad too if you torched my land. That may be true, but this is hardly a normal food chain. Luke, we've confirmed that the thieves are Cheagles. What do you want to do now? What else? We're going to drag these guys down to Engave and... But if we do that, the Ligers will likely attack Engave next in search of food. Then we attack the Ligers. I don't care what happens to that stupid village. You like that place. Well, you didn't like it after they accused you of being the thief, but... That's not acceptable. Food from Engave is shipped throughout the entire world, not just the Malkuth Empire. Then what do we do? Let's negotiate with the Ligers. Negotiation is going to be out of the question. With monsters? Can those Liger things talk too? We can't talk to them directly, but if we take one of the Cheagles with us as a translator... Then, I shall lend this sorcerer's ring to the one who will be your interpreter. Mew. Mew, 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 mew. What the? This child is the one who caused the fire in the north. I want you to take him with you. This will not end well. I am predicting this will Hi, not it's end Mew. well. Nice to meet you. Something about this thing is really annoying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, you're gonna drive me nuts. I should just roast you and eat you right now. What's wrong with you? You're supposed to be the hero. Those Cheagles are really good. Oh, you've been with them for a couple of minutes. Oh, I think they're rather cute, Noel. You're cute. And too, in a Kawi sense. Really, they keep bouncing all over the place. Making all those weird noises. I can't stand them. I think it will be quite soon to have much playing around. Those sacred bee For sacred beasts, I was expecting something. Oh, me too. I was expecting being cheetahs crossed with eagles, you know, something. And that would be, you know, kind of impressive. <laughs> Everyone, watch this! Whoa! He breathed fire! Me, huh? I was probably pronouncing kawaii, kui, what? What was what that? Wrong? Um, I don't speak Japanese. I barely know any of the language. I can breathe fire, so I'm useful for more than just interpreting. I'm going to work extra hard to make up for all the trouble I caused my friends. That's right. I'd forgotten the Cheagles were a fire-breathing species. Fire-breathing cheetah eagles? Now you're just, now you're just trolling me. 
We were what you could have been and had. <laughs> yes, we are. But mine is special. Special? I'm still a child, so I can't actually breathe fire. But... But... The sorcerer's ring. Thanks to that, I can breathe fire. The sorcerer's ring. Mm, anything like the philosopher's stone? And no matter how much fire I breathe out, I never get tired. So the Sorcerer's Ring is good for more than just translation, huh? Yeah, you just said that. It was originally made to amplify phonic arts. It's a type of capacity core. But a flame of that size isn't going to be of much use in battle. It'll help, it'll help. It's flame, it's gonna help. Yeah, but come on, breathing fire, that'll be fun. Hey, you, think. Luke. That's horrible. Oh, shut up. It's fine for this little freak. Yeah. Listen up, Thing. When I give the order, you spit fire. Got it? Mew. Yes, sir. Call him Mew. That's his name. Square to launch fire. Hmm. Fire! Fire! I've seen proceed by present X or like, like a Zelda. He's saying it's your fault we're being. No, we're not. Oh. Oh, he's saying it's your fault being threatened by the liars, dude. And he's talking to me. If he was talking to me, then we have a serious problem on our hands because I just got here. This is, this is absolutely gorgeous. Tigers is well that's what it is is in real life. But that's the name. Wait. Who did that on? You can't deny that, that is amazing. That is nice. That is like 